Hello antique friends and welcome to my channel for another antique related video. My name is Deanna and I'm the owner of Vintage Touch Antiques. Today I'd like to introduce you, take you on a little journey to my uh, web presence where I utilize this as my web page. I have a link to this page in the description of all of my videos, and I've mentioned it a number of times in my videos, but today I thought maybe it would be nice to just take you there and show you around. I'm using this uh, screen, um, what's it called, screencast o that I uh, got the tip from Vincent Romano26, who is one of my new YouTube friends. So a big shout out to Vince and thank you Vince for the tip. This has probably been around some time but I just never really knew how to you know find it, use it, but I saw him using it and I thought it was, looked very interesting. So here we go. Um, I'm going to start. I've got my web page up here. Now this page is like I said um, I utilize this as a web page. It is part of the iAntiqueOnline.com antique and a, a social network community. It uh, is a wonderful place, and I have been here probably since 2008. I don't have the exact date, but I believe that's when I joined. This site has swelled to well over 18,000 members, and so it makes an ideal place to have a web page because of all the options that you get and because of the instant exposure. So this is why I chose this rather than putting up my own web page and trying to promote it. I get a lot of exposure right away just because I've joined this site. You have, like I said, unlimited options for photos and videos and so it becomes um, a wonderful tool. What I have up here on the screen right now, I'm going to go through. Um, this is where you will land if you click on my link in my YouTube video. Or if you were to use my shortened version of my webpage URL, which would be tinyurl.com slash vintage touch. Uh, if you clicked on the home button here, it would take you to the main page of the iAntique online site. And each um, member has their own page. This is the one that I have up here. On the right side, coming down this right column, this would be on anybody's page. And it is on here from the editor of the iAntique Online Network, Diane Zywick. She has a list of blogs and other things that she is promoting and um, gives you links there on the right. So except for that space, the rest of the space is basically yours. It does have a certain format. You can move things around somewhat. Um, I have mine designed so that I have a gallery of photo albums that come up initially. You can use a slideshow presentation. You can use nothing and just your activity will come up. So whatever you do is fine, it's your choice. But I chose this because the slideshow um, presentation was not showing up on the mobile devices, and so I thought this was a better initial um, look for when you bring this up. Now using this mobile devices, let me just add that if um, you don't get this format, um, you can click on the little menu option at the top of the screen and choose the desktop view and that should give you um, your options for this particular screen. Looking at my screen here, you um, can click on customize here and customize it somewhat with colors and, and format. Um, there's a share buttons there for uh, Facebook, uh, Twitter and um, some others that you can just click on the share button there and choose. <clears throat> You've got blog posts, discussion groups, uh, you can schedule events and put the dates and so forth on here. You can join uh, quite a few groups. There's a quite a variety of groups. I monitor, I moderate two of them. Um, great groups and interaction with social um, 
socialization with other antique dealers and antique collectors. And then your photo options and your photo albums, which I use as a way to categorize my antiques and give you a way to view items just based upon the category. And also videos, which I have selected a number of videos that I have posted here on this site. But of course, you can see all of my videos by going to my YouTube channel. So beginning with the photos, I'd like to introduce you to that because in my photo section, I choose many of the pieces that I'm delivering to my antique booth in Antique Crossroads, Hagerstown, Maryland, and post them on here on my webpage with prices and short description. If you will bring up the photo tab, you will see my photos come up. The newest items that have been added will appear first. You can click on any item and it will give you the price, the descript short description, and where you can contact me if you're interested in purchasing other than through my shop. Because I have an online store, I can easily, or most generally, if it's still available, retrieve the item and place it on, uh, list it on my online store so that it can be purchased online. So don't hesitate to um, contact me with the information that you'll see in the, in the photo description there if you are interested. So you can see I have a number of pages, 21 in fact, and I have right now loaded on to this site 408 different photos. If you click on the album section, which is at the top right now, it's on the left initially, you can see the category categories that I have selected for um, my antiques if you want to view them by category. Like for instance, this is hats and bonnets, men's and women's. You could click on photos and images and this will bring up a number of different um, antique photos. different kinds of things like that and so you get the idea. Going back here to my photo album page, I've got a number of photo albums. I've got two, you have to go to the second page to see them all. I even have a um, album of reduced merchandise and that will bring up items that have been reduced for you. I have some booth pictures if you're interested as a dealer to see how I set up my booth. I have an e-crater which shows just a few of the items that I have that are antique items on e-crater. And so you get the idea and so when I um, when I do deliver to my vintage touch antique booth I always mention in my video try to mention that you know that these things are going to be on display in my antique booth. Okay, well, not everything gets videoed. So let me just tell you that. I do make deliveries twice a week generally. I just, um, I don't do a video every week. And so some things are delivered that are not on video. Um, also, I don't take photos of everything, but I do take photos of a lot of things and a lot of those items might be on here on this site rather than in the video so you want to check both and of course the best way to find out what i have for sale in my antique booth is to visit me at antique crossroads hagerstown maryland you'll find the vintage touch antique booth on the left side of the mall third row on the left just look for the big sign that hangs over my double space booth that says vintage touch antiques so that's a little commercial commercial there on the side. Okay, so going back here to, I'm going to click on my page so that I can get the initial page here up for you again. And I'm going to show you that on the left side of my page, you will see a list of, it's, it's done by a feed, uh, the list of the most recent uploads to my YouTube channel. But if you click on more after that, 
it'll take you directly to my YouTube channel where you can find a variety of videos that are antique related videos. Underneath of that are my groups, and there's a number of groups that you can join on iAntique Online and socialize about antiques. I do moderate two of those groups. I have my profile information in the middle section here on this page. Uh, a lot of links there where I can you can click on to follow me online. My friends section on the left. Under that are some of the videos that I've selected for this um, site, this page. And under that, I even have a widget that will show you some of the pieces that you can find on my eCreator online store. Under that, you'll see blog posts. And it's a, like I said, there is a lot of options and a lot of things that you can do on this and so I encourage you to join you might want to use this as an option so I thank you for watching I hope this has been very helpful to you in a variety of ways as a dealer or as a buyer and informative so um, check me out give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and be sure to check me out at the shop if you get a chance to be in the Hagerstown, Maryland area. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day.